We've had a great time doing comics here in the classroom, as we always do. And I've appreciated all the different people that have been chiming in on social media, on Twitter and Instagram, liking our work and retweeting it and such. So we put together a little video of some highlights of some of our work. And uh, wanted to mention, because a lot of students have asked, where do you get these cool pens we've been using? So uh, I'm not actually being paid by this company or anything like that. These are Uniball uh, Rollerball Vision pens. You can get them at, at any office back staples, any kind of place like that. Um, got the idea for using these from uh, Linda Berry's wonderful book, Making Comics, which was our sort of our textbook that we were using for a lot of our ideas and exercises. So uh, for those of you that are asking about it, it's the Uniball Vision uh, Rollerball Pen. So there we go. So enjoy some comics. All right, we so we have the new issue of Kazappi. So here's the guy. He's got his umbrella. There's the threatening storm clouds with frowns. Umbrella goes up. Lightning comes down. He is blown apart. And that's the end of this guy. Did he have a name? Did he have nope. a name? Oh, okay. Just but the name of the comic strip is Kazappi. One of the great one of the great comic strip names of all time. That's great. Kazappi. Uh, so now we're doing a little bit of inking here. using our Sharpies and black pens to add a little definition to our really cool comics. Neat. All right, so looking in on third grade cartoonists in action, we have Crazy Heart Man and Almost Dead Tooth. And Flying Siamese. And what's this? Oh, Flying Siamese. <laughs> Excellent. Brush your teeth, he says. Meow. All right, so we're looking at this comic now, and it is taking an interesting turn. Did you have anything that, that gave you the idea to do that, Jackson? Just to make it like fall off the page like that? That's kind of... It just came to my head. It's great. Because like, why, yeah, why, why do they have to be all lined up? Oh, and I notice you have the sun in these ones here, like, is like going from panel to panel. It's the same thing. That's a cool image. Yeah. It's kind of like those uh, Captain America, Jim Steranko pages we looked at. And this is a baby, this is a baby, this is a baby. All of these are babies. Okay. Because I'm making a baby comic. A baby comic, okay. It's do all they, about babies. Uh, do they all know each other? Or? Yes, they all know each other. Okay. And are they, what are they going to do next? What's going to happen next? Mm. Well, I'm only making one page. I'll oh, make okay. the page next time you do it. No, oh, okay. You're only making one page. So there's all the characters. Yes, but next what they're doing in the comic is gonna be really cool. Next time we do next time we we do it. Yeah, okay. So I have to wait till the next class to find out what happens next? Yes. Oh, okay. And once I'm all done with that one, mm -hmm. I just have to make the front cover and the back cover. Wow, that's then, it. Then there you go. I sometimes do those ones where I do the, um, I'll do the random shape thing we did, like just start with those and see if it gives me any ideas. That's, that's just one of the things I do.